Though there are many ways to needle a chest in the case of a pneumothorax, let's take a look at a refined version of the technique featuring my colleague, Gary Geis. Performing a needle thoracostomy begins with selecting the appropriate site, in this case the second left intercostal space. Next, clean the area with chlorhexidine or betadine. Have your equipment ready ahead of time. This includes a stopcock attached to extension tubing and a 60 ml syringe. Attach a 14 gauge angiocath needle to a syringe filled with saline. Insert the needle over the top of the rib while aspirating, looking for air bubbles. These bubbles indicate that you are in the pleural space, which is filled with air in the case of a pneumothorax. Next, thread the catheter over the needle, removing the needle and syringe, and hook up to the extension tubing. Adjust the stopcock so that it is open to the syringe and pull back until you feel resistance. Once you have pulled off the desired amount of air and the patient stabilizes, you can then close the stopcock, thus closing the system. If the patient decompensates, you can open the stopcock again to pull off more air.